Lamborghini calls the Temerario a high-performance electrified vehicle, or HPEV, and it packs a twin-turbocharged 4.0-liter V8 plug-in hybrid setup with three electric motors. Total output is 920 horsepower, and it takes the Temerario just 2.7 seconds to reach 62 miles per hour. Top speed is 211 miles per hour. Lamborghini built this new V8 engine from the ground up. It has a 90-degree, hot V, configuration in a flat plane crankshaft, with two turbochargers running a maximum pressure of 36 psi. Cast aluminum alloy cylinder heads and titanium connecting rods help keep the weight down, while diamond-like carbon DLC coated finger followers in the valve train ensure the engine can spin up to 10,000 revolutions per minute. Three oil-cooled, axial flux electric motors join the V8. Lamborghini stuck the rear motor between the engine and the transversely mounted 8-speed dual-clutch gearbox. That electric motor alone produces up to 150 horsepower and 221 pound-feet of torque. The other two motors, located on the front axle, drive the front wheels and make 82 horsepower each. Yes, this new Lambo is all-wheel drive, but don't worry, there is a drift mode function that deploys torque at the rear wheels at three varying power levels. The Temerario also has a launch control function. The battery pack has a capacity of 3.8 kWh. Plug the Temerario into a traditional AC charging port with up to 7 kW of power, and the battery will recharge in 30 minutes. It can also be recharged through regenerative braking, or directly from the V8 in as little as 6 minutes. You can drive using the front electric motors exclusively, but Lamborghini doesn't list an EV driving range for the Temerario. Visually, the Temerario looks like a mix of the larger Revuelto and the outgoing Huracan. The headlights take up a small sliver of each corner of the hood, they're slimmer even than the Huracans, and trendy hexagonal LED running lights sit just beneath them on each side of the front bumper. The Temerario has staggered 20 and 21-inch wheels with forged or carbon fiber options. In profile, the Temerario isn't as sleek as the Huracan. It introduces a larger aerodynamic vent just ahead of the rear wheels that improves downforce by 103% compared to the Huracan Evo. The Temerario Allegory to lightweight package, with a larger rear wing, unique bumper treatments, and carbon fiber rims, debuts at launch and touts a 158% increase in downforce over the Huracan Evo, and a 55-pound weight reduction over the standard Temerario. Tack on the carbon pack, and that drops another 4 pounds through the use of carbon on the rear diffuser, mirror caps, and side air intakes. The Temimerario has a cockpit-style cabin littered with hexagonal elements. Headroom improves by 1.3 inches over Huracan, and legroom improves by up to 1.8 inches. Even a 6-foot 6-inch NBA player could wear a helmet in this car, says Lamborghini. An 8.4-inch vertical touchscreen graces the center of the dash, while the driver has access to a 12.3-inch digital instrument cluster and the passenger has a slightly smaller 9.1-inch touchscreen display. One thing we don't know yet is how much the Lamborghini Temerario costs. The outgoing Huracan Evo started at around $300,000 in the US, so it wouldn't be out of the realm of possibility that the Temerario costs around $400,000 or even $500,000. We'll know more about the Lamborghini Temerario when it goes on sale later this year or early in 2025.